This is the sound test for review. The oil dollar pair dove 3% in the last session. The stochastic indicator is giving a positive signal. The pound fell 0.5% against the dollar in the last trading session. The ultimate oscillator is giving a negative signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. Nike's stock saw a minor rise of 0.3% in the last session. The ROC is giving a positive signal. The gold dollar pair plummeted 1.1% in the last session. The ROC is giving a negative signal. Moving on to world financial news. U.S. Judge Sarah Netburn granted Ripple Labs' motion to serve two subpoenas to authenticate seven video recordings in which U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission's officials made public remarks. Oil prices slumped, weighed by concerns over slowing Chinese economic growth, as well as raised potential for increased supply from both Iran and Saudi Arabia. Reports of slower growth at China's factories and retail sales drove down oil prices. U.S. stocks dropped as China printed lower-than-expected economic data and unexpected interest rate cuts, prompting concerns about the outlook for global growth. Thank you. Coming up, our chief analyst review of today's most interesting economic events. The UK's ILO unemployment rate will be released at 0600 hours GMT. Germany's ZEW survey, current situation, at 0900 GMT. The UK's claimant count change at 0600 GMT. The US Red Book Index will be released at 1255 GMT. Japan's exports at 2350 GMT. The US housing starts at 1230 GMT.